This video will show how to relocate user folders. It is based on a tutorial by Sean Brink on seven forms. A link is provided at the bottom of this video. The video was done on Windows 10, but works exactly the same on Windows 7 and Windows 8. First, we want to open a window to see users, your username. We want to open another window to the location of where you want to move the user files to. In my case, the data drive. You can use any folder structure you want. I prefer keeping the same, user, the same folder structure as on the C drive. We are going to duplicate the folders in C users on the data drive with the exception of the OneDrive folder. This just gives us a place to put the user folders when we move them. Just continue this until all of the, all of the folders have been created. Now that we've completed creating our new folders, we're going to begin moving the user folders. Take each folder, right click it, select properties, select the location tab, and click move. Now you're going to go over to your data drive and you're going to find the corresponding folder that you just created. Select that folder, click Apply. Be sure and click at Yes, and then click OK. Then go to the next folder and do the exact same thing. Continue this process until all the folders have been moved. Now we can go check our folders. You'll see that all the new user, all the old user folders are now on your data drive. Everything in your operating system will work exactly the same as it did before. If you want to check and make sure where the folders are, you right click them, select properties, and you'll notice they're on my E drive now. They're not on the C drive any longer. And that's it.
We've successfully moved our user folders to another drive. 